All right, this is Ohm's Law Decoded. But this is for the beginners that are just getting into the hobby of electronics and are struggling with the formulas on how to, how to calculate this stuff. It's not hard. Once you understand how to use the formula, you're, you're all set. So I'm going to teach you that right now, and hopefully you can you know, pick it up fairly quickly. These two formulas here will calculate pretty much everything you need to know Verse uh, applying to volts, current, resistance, and wattage. Okay, so the way these formulas work is you divide, this is a division line, E is an energy, is volts, I is current, R is resistance, P is power, I is current, E is energy, as in volts. Okay, always divide from top to bottom from energy to current or energy to resistance or power over energy or power over I'm sorry power, power yeah power over energy power over current don't divide up or else you're going to skew your measurements and it's going to screw you up and this line here is a multiply line okay so you're going to multiply your current times your resistance or your current times your energy which is your volts that is going to calculate your other piece of the pie here okay so whatever you multiply to variables or two two numbers together you're gonna get the third piece of the pie answer okay so if you want to know this you divide this into this if you want to know this you divide this into this it's that simple so let's just take for instance 120 volt, 120 volt light bulb uh, 60 60 watts all right so we got 120 60 watts all right, so here's your voltage, okay, and here's your power, which is your wattage. Now you divide your 60 watts over your 120 volts, and you get 0.5 amps. That's how much a 120 volt light bulb at 60 watts is drawing on your on your uh, on your power. Okay, let's take this formula now let's take uh, let's say 12 volts at 220 ohm resistor you want to find the current that's flowing through that resistor you got 12 volts 220 ohm you would take your resistor and put it here and your voltage and put it here so 12 divided into 220 ohms is 0 0.054 and some change so you're looking at about 54 milliamps flowing across that resistor. It's that simple. Now if you want to find out the resistance of your light bulb filament, you would take the answer that you got here and put it here, okay? And you know your energy, all right? So your 120 volts divide into 0.5 amps and you will get 240 ohms. Measure your 60 watt light bulb. I bet you it's 240 ohms, 40 ohms. And that's it. It's that simple. So I hope that helps with uh, you people learning and getting into the hobby. And, and that's it. Have a great day.